Hello YouTube, this is my queen's eye back with another video, back with another message. I hope you guys are doing well. Thank you guys for all of the support, all of the likes, comments, shares, subscribes, everything is greatly appreciated. Thank you so much. Um, So I got stick to the script, but when I got that, I saw the five of swords, the ace of swords, and the magician here. So for some of you with that stick to the script, it's like... You went by like your own script or your own rules. Okay. Heavy on a payout. You predicted um things that happened too. Like if things went like if they magically disappeared, I picked this up like a year ago. Or maybe not even a year ago where I said um, it's like something was like going to like magically appear. Like something magically disappeared and it's like magically appearing again. Take it how it resonates. And it's causing a lot of um, strife because I saw the five of wands. But here's the hermit with the five of cups. Sad scene. Let me um let me get a prayer in. If somebody else like had their own script that they were sticking to here, it did not end good for them. Okay. Let me get a prayer in real quick. Most high loving ancestors of my highest good, my highest light, my highest frequency. Please help me to channel these messages clear and concise with truth and clarity. Please block any and all negative interference during this message. Please return to center tenfold. Thank you. Queen of Wands here. <clears throat> I got sunflower because it's a sunflower, but when I got sunflower, I heard the day of light. And that's all the ten of swords. But here's the nine. Like, so somebody's like bright days are dark. Cause like I said, you could have predicted things or certain things that happened already. And whoever this Queen of Wands is, you just take how it resonates. This could have been somebody that was um, felt like they were sticking to their own script here. But like, however, like whatever script they were reading or something like that, the ending that this person had is not the ending that is before them. So uh, heavy on the people like playing out movies in life, like in real life. <clears throat> and that shit is catching up to them because these really be people that watch, right? They just swords, they watch, right? And they be like, shit, I can do that. And it's like, shit, you want to tell yourself, tell yourself you believe in yourself, but what is your intention and what are your actions? Like all eyes is on this queen of wands now. Whoever this is, Temperance with the will of fortune here. <clears throat> There's people gathering information about this Queen of Wands. Or asking questions, same thing, but Temperance with the Five of Cups. Like, I don't know if this is somebody who is in regret because of how balanced you are. Or if this is somebody that's in this Five of Cups energy because they are now seeing, like, how everything happens in divine time with that temperance energy. And <clears throat> just take it how it resonates. Anything else? Thank you. Six of Wands here. 
heavy on the public exposure here. I'm trying to tell you. This is like somebody walking down the street and people like staring and looking and being like, yo, that's her. <laughs> that shit's crazy, yo. But I mean, shit, you know how that shit feel, right? Motherfuckers see you walking down the street and they like, yo, is that such and such? And they motherfuckers be like, yup, yup, yup. Page of swords, yup, you see her? This how somebody, this the energy somebody in right now and they don't like that shit. Because like I said, see, they thought that their ending was going to be like a success. And it's not. It's the Ten of Swords. I just showed y'all the nine. <clears throat> Here's the tower. Oh, I cracked the deck on it. <laughs> just said I saw it. The hangman here. And here's the nine of swords. With the three of swords. <clears throat> cups, four of cups, six of pentacles with the emperor, ten of wands. <clears throat> Heavy on the camouflaging. Like somebody did something to fit in purposely. See, this is what I'm talking about. If somebody, like, if you got your own script as to how you did something or why you were doing something, like, you stuck to that shit. And like I said, whatever, whoever this Queen of Wands is, whatever script that they were sticking to, is actually stuck to them. Hey, man, they're stuck. It's stuck to them. Because now... They're going to get the attention that they've been so desperately trying to seek. Like I said, Queen of Wands, Page of Swords, Six of Wands. Damn, that's her. Yo, did you hear with the Page of Swords? Did you hear? And it's going to have somebody in this Nine of Swords, yo. Or, or this is like the energy right now. You just take it how it resonates. Seven of Swords here. The World, Ten of Pentacles, Nine of Wands. Magician here, Page of Wands. Will of Fortune, High Priestess, Empress. Like this is going to be like um, so I just I just saw the never ending story card in my mind's eye. That's from the wisdom of the Oracle deck. This is going to be a never ending uh, story, a never ending like, like this is always going to be talked about here. Because motherfuckers is going to uh, partner up with people that two of cups that I saw, they going to partner up with somebody. They going to be like, yo, did you hear about that shit with this person's health? Hey, listen, did you sleep with that person? Because if you did, we need to go get checked. Have you on the putting people in awareness here? Or getting people aware. Magician, page of wands, will of fortune, high priestess with the empress. You're making people aware or you've made them aware. Good job. That was you sticking to your script. Because if you're not sure of your role, you shouldn't be out here just doing any fucking thing. If you out here trying to play the role of an empress, but you're the queen of wands... Please understand your please. And somebody's learning it, yo. Because again, like I said, when you was walking down the street and you this, you the empress and motherfuckers like was like, oh, that's the queen of wands. Like motherfuckers was really like, yo, that's the queen of wands. You, you ain't hear this shit about her. And motherfuckers kept talking about that shit over and over and over again. Ain't nobody say shit to you, though. Cause it was all a fucking secret, right? But you stuck to the script. And the script that other motherfuckers was sticking to, it stuck to them. Nine of swords to the four, that's five. And I saw the five of swords, but here's the five of wands speaking through. Six of cups here. Nine of cups, king of wands. All somebody did was try to get a fucking man. And here's the five of swords. Ace of swords. Eight of swords. You see? 
See, the first time I saw the Five of Swords and the, the Ace of Swords, I saw it with the Magician right here. That's where I got stick to the script. And like I just said, whatever script that somebody else was sticking to, it's gotten them caught. It's stuck to them. Because the truth will always be what the fuck it is. It does not matter how many lies you tell. It does not matter how many people you got. None of that shit matters, yo. When it's time for fucking karma, you're going to get that shit. Because karma sticks to the script. Karma don't miss a beat. And motherfuckers wanted you to miss a beat and you didn't. And even if you did, you was put right back on track. They don't know how you did it. That's what I just heard. They don't know how you did it. This is why knowing self is so fucking important, yo. Or learning self. Like all somebody wanted to do was learn how to get more attention. Okay. <clears throat> you were trying to learn like if you had gifts or... Like what you could create or like how you could manifest. Like you would write down heavy um, Lion's Gate portal. That's heavy. That's significant. I don't know why I just picked that up. Because I think last year or the year before, I actually wrote down the manifestation on that date. 8-8. Eight, eight, the 8-8 eight, eight portal. Heavy on the what goes around comes around here. Y'all see that right there? Over the top of the magician's head. When you think abundant, that's what will come. When you think five of swords, seven of swords, nine of swords, ten of swords, yeah, all that shit gonna come back to you. And somebody's stuck. This is like somebody that refused to heal, like whatever type of hurt that they experienced in a trauma, could have been a breakup or Something like that. Like, instead of somebody, like, healing, they, like, overlooked it. Only for them to be put in a place or in a position where they still have to heal. Because there is no shortcuts. You getting attention from other people, that's not healing. You should be giving that shit to yourself. Because that's healing. Motherfuckers trying to have people watch you and stalk you and spy on you and gang stalk you and all that shit. Like, yo, real shit. Like, three, four years ago, I didn't know what none of this shit was, yo. None of it. And up until about three, four years ago, motherfuckers was able to get away with some shit because I was unaware of myself. And motherfuckers want to know how the fuck you did it. It's you isolating yourself. It's you healing. It's you getting to the core of whatever problems you have to make you go out here and be a certain type of way. If anybody in this world, and I said the world, if they say they don't have no nothing to heal from, they're fucking lying. And they are someone that's of this world. But now... The Most High wants healing. He wants change. So by any means, he's going to get what he wants. Because like I said, where people like brushed off healing, four of swords to the eight, that's four of swords. They're still healing. We got the four of wands right here. Five of Pentacles, somebody about to get put out here. Or well, somebody's losing um, some type of investment. I did see the Seven of Pentacles. Or somebody has a home that belongs to you. 
and they going to have to get that shit up. For some of you, this person sold a house that belongs to you. You're about to get that shit back. Take it how it resonates. We got the lovers here. Somebody got abandoned by a um a divine masculine or a divine feminine. Take it how it resonates. Or somebody is like not good at making good choices or healthy choices. Five of Wands here. It's like somebody, it's like somebody tries to bring you chaos and conflict because even with you being by yourself, you still make healthy choices here. You're still able to maintain some type of stability when you were like evicted or you had to leave or people put you out and shit like that. Like you still was able to make healthy choices and you're able to maintain. So now like the shoe is on the other foot where motherfuckers was smearing your fucking name and then see you walking down the street talking about, yo, is that her? But ain't none of them bitches or none of them niggas, ain't none of them junk. But everybody talking about everybody health or your health. And I said it before, if this was motherfuckers said that you was giving them something, something lifelong, because that's what I said in that video, and ain't nobody said shit to you, Cause ain't a motherfucker gonna tell me that I gave them some shit and I ain't saying nothing. I'm just saying. Ain't no way. But these was motherfuckers like, yo, let's just keep this shit a secret. Cause we know who she is for real, but we got to deal with these trash ass bitches over here because they talking about we can get money off of this shit. See? Cause this a dumb bitch that was looking at power one night and was like, oh shit. Oh, yeah. Oh, I, all I got to do is get a motherfucking team together and we can do this shit. And they said to they self, self, and they dumb ass said, huh? You want to try to get this money and lie on this empress here and fuck they health up or fuck up their life or fuck with their person or fuck with their stability? And they dumb ass self said, uh-huh. And then they had a other bunch of motherfuckers talking about, uh-huh. Now these motherfuckers talking about, uh-uh. I don't want this shit. No, that is what the fuck you want. Because that was the script that you wanted to stick to. Well, that's your story, right? Somebody need to listen to my story, R. Kelly. Because now motherfuckers looking at you like, oh, shit. Damn, that's her. That's the one. Yeah, that's the fucking one, you nut. This motherfucker's tripping, yo. Tripping. Like, for some of you, this Queen of Wands was already told about you. Ace of Swords with the, with the I was going to say with the lovers. So, but somebody was already told about you from the beginning. I don't know what that was about, but take it how it resonates. And somebody had it out for you. The death card at the bottom of the deck. They had it out for you. Well, if that's you, that's you sticking to your script, actually trying to get an empress up out of the way because you want to be with a man or you want to be with a woman here, you already sealed like your fate. The will of fortune is out here. You already sealed your fate. Because this person didn't do shit to you. So you just goofy as shit. Just out here lying on a motherfucker. You ain't asking them no questions. But a motherfucker said, yeah, I can give you some money. All you got to do is lie on this person. And the stupid motherfucker said, okay. Well, okay, stupid. Stick to the motherfucking script. All the way to the end. Like, motherfuckers trying to take you up out of here and you trying to bring change. Like, you're trying to bring fucking healing. I say it all the time. You don't want to heal. Take your fucking self up out of here. Either way, you're going to be fucking moved. Either way. Whether it's your prison cell, 
or your fucking coffin. Either way. Because that's the choices right now for people. For some, this is already like solidified. This death energy, it's already been solidified. But for other people, their shit, they're starting to see like, yo, is that, uh, uh-huh, hold on. So it's like, okay, because you waited so long with that Knight of Pentacles I saw, prison or death. See, for some of you, these motherfuckers are going to get sentenced to death, but you take it how it resonates. You just can't be going after any fucking body because you're unaware of self. Because even with you, Empress, being unaware of who you are or who you were, take it how it resonates, you never went after nobody. So if these is motherfuckers like using a past as to why they did this and why they did that, you got a fucking past too. You ain't let that shit stop you. You ain't let that shit take nobody. Let, let you take nobody life. That shit ain't make you like intentionally hurt motherfuckers. That shit didn't make you trap people up in situations. That shit did not stop you from making healthy fucking choices here. And somebody wants to use that as to why the fuck they did what they did. That shit not going to work. So I did a video where I said something's going to be inadmissible at court. That's what this is. Because this somebody that's going to be like, this is my story. Okay, but this was this Empress's story too. And look how they changed. Look how they transformed. What's your excuse? Just because you refuse to believe in yourself doesn't mean that the next motherfucker does. Like you really went down a path blindfolded, yo. This is why you really coming out on top. Especially for these sorry ass niggas out here. If they do this shit to bras that they don't fucking know or females that they don't know, imagine what they going to do to motherfuckers that they do know. Now, I'm going to let that shit marinate and I'm going to continue on. Like, somebody thought you was a real, like, easy target, yo. With this target right here, that's that's what I'm getting. Like, somebody thought you was an easy fucking target. They get some type of entity attached to you. Star with this devil-ass energy. Like, this is what somebody was in a past life. Okay, when the fuck are you going to change your life? Okay, you was the best at being evil or being a Jezebel or whatever the fuck this devil energy is. Okay, you proved to be the best at that. Now, what fucking good can you bring? Because motherfuckers told you was an easy target. This shit hard as shit, yo. That's why they fucking scared. They losing their mind. All of that shit. Because maybe you was this in a past life. I don't know. Just take it out and resonate for you. So if this was you in a past life and you done changed, you done transformed, you done did whatever it is that you needed to do to heal, to do different, this is somebody who looked at your past life and said, oh shit, I can do that shit too. Them not looking at the present or the future, you see? So again, like I said, everybody got a past. I don't give a fuck if it's this lifetime that you got a past or a past life. What fucking good did you bring? And <clears throat> what change did you bring? Because I said earlier, awareness is half the battle. And like I said, if this motherfucker's where this shit gonna come out, they're gonna be like, oh shit, that's who that is. That's who was sick. That's who was doing this. That's who was doing that. And it's like, yeah, listen, if you had sex with that person, we need to go get checked. 
Like, that's the type of change that you're fucking bringing. Because people never did that shit. And maybe at some point you didn't. But you accepted that shit and you changed it. You still made healthy choices. So the shit, you only make it harder for yourself when you don't make healthy choices. People wanted you to intentionally make bad fucking choices because they're not good at like listening to their own intuition or uh, trusting their own judgment. <laughs> Temperance here. The angel of death. I just heard the angel of death has been called with this judgment, death, and the temperance. The sun with the devil here. Seven of Pentacles. Emperor Seven of Wands. Somebody's this emperor is being protected from whoever this devil energy is. Or they need to like <clears throat> block out any illusions that somebody is still trying to send. Because like I said, this was a motherfucker who said shit. I'm going to stick to the script. Okay, but understand the ending that you think is going to happen is not. It's going to be death. And if somebody want to ride that shit all the way to the wheels, fall off by all fucking means. But you're going to understand and you're going to respect motherfuckers' boundaries, though. Because that be the fucking problem. But this a motherfucker who be demanding respect. This bitch don't even respect her fucking self. I don't give a fuck if it's one or fifty. This a motherfucker who come for any and everybody. But let somebody talk about them the truth. I got to emphasize on that. Let a motherfucker speak the truth on this broad. And now they got a fucking problem. Well, guess the fuck what? Everybody else got a problem too. The ones that's dead. The ones that got hurt. The ones whose name was smeared. The ones you had in the third party. The ones you made sick. The ones you got locked up. The ones you locked up. So whoever the fuck this Queen of Wands is, they just really need to shut the fuck up. Because they don't have jurisdiction over you, over your energy, over nothing. They don't even have this shit over their life. But want to demand fucking respect. You should have been doing that when your ass was out here being a fucking whore. Demand fucking respect. If anybody come for me, I'm going to do, you're not going to do shit but get your fucking ass whipped. Six of Swords, somebody being guided away or been guided away from this person here. Devil, Star, Page of Cups. Let me tell you something. This is what this person been doing since they was a fucking kid, yo. They was a kid. Like I said, you could have went through some type of traumatic experience, but that did not stop you from changing or transforming your life. And this is what somebody was trying to do, like swap out destinies. That shit is impossible. But by all means, go ahead. Stick to the script. Go ahead. Because everything motherfuckers will try and do to you, you overcame that shit, yo. This person not overcoming this shit. They fell for the bait. Well, you know, you're big. Somebody thought you was a motherfucking fish. Somebody really thought that, that, that they could get the fuck over on you. Where that page of cups go? <laughs> Somebody really thought like, like, cause you was a little fish or that's how they saw you. It was like, oh yeah, I'm a shark. I'm a bite they ass all way. And you probably did get bit, but you fucking hell. This somebody who got bit over and over and over again. This somebody who got sick over and over and over again. And did not heal. That's a big fucking difference. Eight of Pentacles here. Nine of Pentacles. With the two of Swords here. Ten of Pentacles. I 
hierophant here. Somebody could have um tried to like see you somewhere or like if it's online or out in the street or something like that. For some of you, people be riding by you and they be wanting to say something to you. Like I said, for some of you, people do see you. It could be people that you used to deal with. And it's like they see you now and it's like, yo, that's her. That's him. So heavy, heavy on the being like overlooked, going to overbooked. I'm going to pull out my index cards. And heavy on to somebody getting booked. It's something about books, ledgers, money, all that shit. Motherfuckers got you fucked up. Like you can't, I said it in another reading, you can't be demanding something that you're not even willing to give yourself. Or the other person that you're demanding it from. You don't give yourself that shit. Who the fuck won't give a fuck about what you want? Because I'm not. And if a motherfucker ain't learned that shit yet about me, stay the fuck tuned. Because people going to understand that you're favored here. You and your family. Ace of Cups to the ten. Ten of Pentacles with the Hierophant. Like, just stop. For some of you, this is people that's connected to you that's about to be shown some type of favor because of who this person is. Or what they were hiding or some shit like that. What they got them into, just take how it resonates. And I'm going to be honest. For whoever these people are, this Ace of Cups is going to be enough. Because whatever this Queen of Wands was getting, it just wasn't never the fuck enough. You know why? Because they were never fulfilled. Because they never healed. So when motherfucker not heal and they out here doing all this extra shit, thinking that it's going to make them fulfilled in some type of way, it's like, damn, why do I have this house but I still feel like shit? Do you think it's because your stupid ass need to heal and let some shit go? Or you just going to sweep that shit under the rug <laughs> and move on to your next victim. Heavy on that you saved somebody's life, whether it was before this situation came out or right now. Because I did a video a minute ago. I think it was the King of Wands and the Nine of Wands came out. And I said that whoever that King of Wands is, they made it out just in fucking time. Because had they went back to this Queen of Wands, they ass would have been grass. I'm just going to say it like that. We got the Eight of Cups. I'm trying to tell you, somebody got the fuck out of Dodge. Somebody literally like dodged a bullet. Away. It could don't have to be a physical bullet. It could be a relationship, a job, a home, a place, a person. Just take it how it resonates. But somebody got the fuck out of the way, like right when they were supposed to. Because they kept ignoring all the hits. <laughs> all the hits that somebody was getting, let me knock you the fuck upside of your head again. And again, and again, and again, and again. Until your stupid ass sees that you need to walk the fuck away from whoever this person is. And somebody got the fucking hit. Probably fucked him up. Probably got a little dizzy. Yeah, here go this fucking page of cups right here. Somebody thought you was like real like easy. Like somebody thought a lot of motherfuckers was real easy to get over on. Oh, them be the ones you got really watch the fuck out for. Especially if they kind and they quiet. Oh. And it's a queen of wands who fucking loud as shit. And then be loud and lying and wrong. And then talking about, I demand respect. Shut the fuck up. Sit the fuck down. And give it to yourself first. Because this somebody who will come back 24 hours later. And say dumb ass shit like this. Oh, well, I respect myself now. 
Well, here's the thing with that. Show a motherfucker instead of telling them. And they can't do it. Five of Cups. They can't do it. And I don't even like to say can't. But this person can't do it. Because they never wanted to put the effort in. They never wanted to even try. So fuck it. Judgment with the death. You're welcome. Reality check I just saw. Somebody getting caught up for embezzlement. This shit been coming out heavy. Somebody went against blood. Somebody went against blood. You go against blood, that's fucking death too. True love comes from within self. But this is why I said, like, I think it was the last reading where I said, like, if you tell the truth, like, you can get help. But if you still out here lying, still trying to get over, there's no help for you. It's none. Conversations are different this go round. Because motherfuckers going to know now how to fucking approach you. Don't fuck with that person, yo. You you ain't hear about this empress, that, that, that queen of wands, they was trying to be like them or they was trying to set them up or get them caught up, get them some type of STD. Like, you ain't hear none of that shit. Damn, yo, that's the same empress we was blaming back in the day. Conversations are about to be different this go round. Hello, how are you? Yeah, what's up? Hm. But see, that's just who the fuck you are, though. <laughs> Somebody left their destiny to chance. But again, like, you're a feeler. So, for some of you, it's like, if somebody is like, Oh, hello, how are you? Okay, how are you? And you'll feel like the way you respond to somebody is because something is off with them. You gotta pay attention. I just picked up on that though. Because even me sitting here reflecting back to times where I've seen people, it was like, hmm. Any other time I would have did it like this. Or like, you understand? So just you just have to be aware. If you feel like you your response to a hello from somebody is off, is something off about them. For some of you, you just like are who you are. Real shit. Because motherfuckers wanted you to accept they shitty ass ways, right? They wanted you to accept that because it was like, well, you either going to accept me or don't accept me at all. And then when you walk the fuck away, it's like, fuck that bitch. Well, well, what the fuck is it? Do you want a motherfucker to leave you or do you want the motherfucker to stay? Now, which one? These motherfuckers don't know they self. They live in that confusion. They want you to do the same thing. No. You walk the fucking way and learn how to co-create with the most high. You said these motherfuckers not for me. Who the fuck are these people? Real shit. This is a confirmation. That joint fell right out on the floor. The confirmation card. Major cover up. Exposed. I'm trying to tell you, yo. And now you're going to be able to like live your life. But some of you, you're about to be like a world star here. Now you take this how it resonates. The World Wide Web is going to be somebody on the world star. Uh, what is that world star? Hip hop or hip hop world star, whatever. But you take it how it resonates for you. You're going to be living your life. The life you should have been fucking living. But the most I had to teach you some lessons too. Stop giving your love away to everybody that does not fucking appreciate that shit. Stop. He said all the love you want to give to those people or all the love you want to receive from those people. No, give it to yourself and, and give it to me. And I'll get you out. Confess your truth. Confess your sins. And that's what you did. Whether you knew you sent or not. For some of you, motherfuckers was going to the most high because people knew they had to communicate through you. And they was going to the most high, telling the most high that you was out here killing people. That's why these motherfuckers about to die. And that's why he had to 
like get you away from these people because it was really people out here in your fucking face talking about you killed motherfuckers. Well, why ain't nobody pick you up yet? It be that fucking part for me. If you know this motherfucker did this shit, why they ain't been picked the fuck up yet? You got all these motherfucking people. See, stupid motherfuckers don't think about that shit. They only think about the money and their next victim. And that's why the Most High has put you in a position to fucking expose these motherfuckers. Good job. Because wasn't no fucking body else going to do this shit. Somebody has permanently lost their gifts. Death. I only saw it when I looked at the five of pentacles, but I knew that the death was out here. Somebody permanently lost their gifts here. Like if they could, they lost them because they was playing around. And this was somebody who actually took somebody's life and tried to fucking blame you for that shit. And that's why these motherfuckers is going to be confessing the fucking truth. Because they're going to clear your name one way or another. It's just what it is. Somebody was trying to live your life and left their destiny to chance here. That shit's crazy. To cover up some shit and now you're exposed. It'd be that part for me. Have you on a new contract here or a new deal or something like that? Yeah, new life. So that could be the contract, this new life. Live your life is out here already. Yeah, recanting lies, I'm trying to tell you. They gonna have to like prove your fucking innocence, yo. You weathered the storm by yourself and all. <laughs> by yourself and all. So again, I ask, what the fuck is the problem for the next motherfucker that went through some type of dinosaur, some type of traumatic experience? What's your excuse as to why you didn't fucking heal? I'm not gonna wait for the fucking answer. I just want motherfuckers to think. Divine Feminine here. It's only like real shit, one of you. But this is why you need to be aware of self. This is why you need to heal. Because everybody is their own individual person. You can't be like another motherfucker. Because you ain't them. I don't care if you got the nigga. I don't care if you got the house. I don't care if you got the money, the cars, the hair. All of that shit, none of that shit matters. What the fuck does your heart, soul, and mind look like? Somebody's being audited here. Or somebody's going through some type of uh, process of something here. Take out how it resonate. I'm telling you, motherfuckers about to get booked. It's a process. Everything is a process, though. But you think how it resonates. Confusion is the devil's tactic. Like I said, motherfuckers like, wait a minute. Hold the fuck up. Wait. I mean, motherfuckers, I said the other day, like, motherfuckers was so sure of the part that they was fucking playing. And now motherfuckers is like, huh? Well, what you talking about? Bitch. You know what the fuck this shit is. That's why I don't be liking to say nothing to people because clearly I'm asking a question for a reason. So the best bet is for you to just be honest. Just be honest from the rip. You lie and you're the high priest is out here. You're going to know. That's what get people fucked up. Because <laughs> they still be like, oh, no, I'm going to stick to the script. Okay, listen, the script is over. The death card been out here. It's over. Heavy on the flush. The flushing. I picked that up either yesterday or the day before. 44.49 was just on the clock.
Heavy on the you being protected. And heavy on the surrendering. So you surrendering, letting something go, purging, releasing, that flush. That's what saved you. That's what saved you. The most high prepared your table in front of your enemies. Tell them thank you. Because I say it all the time. He be tired of me saying thank you, but that's okay because I'm not going to stop. <laughs> the most high didn't bring you this far to leave you. Not you. Uh, Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles, Emperor, Empress. The most high didn't bring you this far to leave you. So if it's still somebody in this energy where they trying to stick to their they script, not the script of the Most High, their own script. That's how you know this motherfucker get ready to lose. Because this somebody who think they more powerful than God. Let me let me keep going. Because I ain't even trying to go there right now. Truth and clarity. That's what I just saw. That's the Ace of Swords. Somebody's cursed. This motherfuckers is cursed, yo. And now motherfuckers is really seeing like, oh my gosh. This is really true. Yeah, it is. It is. Because I said it before. Like, the Most High will cause illusions to the enemy. And somebody got the fuck in my comments and said, the Most High, why would God uh, create illusions? Because you got simple motherfuckers out here that walk like you, that bleed like you, that think that they're more powerful than the Most High. Why wouldn't he? Why wouldn't he make the enemy think that they're a fucking winner over him? Over the most high? The creator of all? And you think you're more powerful than him? I just heard mother, father, God. Excuse me, mother. So, men, you think you're more powerful than father, God? And females, you think you more powerful than mother God? That's why you about to be set the fuck down. Because you need to see, like, what this shit really is. And it's clear, like I said before, motherfuckers that's in this world that have not attempted to heal, they're going to be sat down or put in their fucking grave. It's one or the other. Cause you know a motherfucker be like there is no in between You either fuck with me or you don't And then when you tell a motherfucker you don't fuck with them They try and get you to come back to fuck with them Well which one is it? Is the Empress the dirty one? Or is it the Queen of Wands? Now which one is it? Is it the Emperor that's dirty? Or is it the King of Wands? Which one the fuck is it? Like I said the conversations is different this go round. Different. Very different. Let me get a couple more messages and I'm going to close this drawing out. Guilt with the sabotage. These people about to be found guilty. Look, I said divine time. Was it this video or the last one? But divine time is always at play. People just have to understand that. Now, I'm going to leave that alone right there. But you have to trust in divine time in here. And with the guilt with the divine time, with the present energy right here, they didn't trust. Look at this person's uh, head. They holding their head down. They did not trust. They did not want to believe because they felt like their script was was the best. And it's not. Is this card flipped over here? Venus with the offer here. For some of you, these people was made an offer. That to 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 believe that everything was going to work out in divine time, and people did not want to do that. They sabotaged that. That's that five of swords energy. Well. But again, these are going to be motherfuckers that's not grateful, though. Because this card says gratitude. They didn't want to accept the offer, yo. And that's on them. 
They did not want to be abundant. They wanted to sabotage. Well, you got what the fuck you, you wanted. Now you really get the fucking hill. You see how that shit go? And you get to be a union here. Look with the fate. Divine intervention. That's the tower. For some of you, this offer is coming in from your person here. With this nurture and the compassion. Because you heal. And you guys are going to be like closed off. Heavy on the invite only. And it's going to be a lot of motherfuckers in regret. Wishing that they would have took care of themselves better, yo. And they going to remember. They going to remember every fucking thing they did. Deception with the temptation. With the remember and the awakening. They going to remember every fucking thing they did. Because they not going to have nothing but fucking time. Like I said, somebody went 24 hours and was like, oh, yeah, I respect myself now. Okay, so now with that, it's just showing every 24 hours because 24 hours in a day. So every fucking day, you need to show yourself first that you respect yourself and then other motherfuckers will respect you. But I'm going to tell you something. If motherfuckers didn't respect you, Empress, whenever, however, they fucking respect you now. And for some of you, it's like you don't even want that shit because you don't even fucking care. Because a lot of these motherfuckers was lying on they thing in between their pants just to get some fucking money. These some nut-ass motherfuckers, yo. Ugh. You lie on yourself like that, you deserve every motherfucking thing you get. Man or woman. Motherfuckers don't like that shit, though. But when you was walking down the street, the motherfuckers was like, yo, that's her. Damn, ain't nobody going to say nothing. They like, no, nah, nigga, we going to get this fucking money. And somebody said, with that eight of cups, they said, oh, no. <laughs> I'm not doing that. But, you know what I mean? Like, it is what it is. That's why your intention counts, yo. Motherfuckers be like, oh, no, it doesn't even matter if you know it does. It does. How you go into a situation will determine your fucking outcome. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, we. So, guys, that's the end of the message. Thank you so much for tuning in, and I will talk to you guys on the next one. Peace.